Pura Vida. I'm here in Costa Rica at Hacienda del Sol getting prepped for our January 21st and 22nd workshops. I'd love to provide you with four exercise circuit that will help you to strengthen your balance from proprioception. Now firstly, I'd like to teach a little bit about proprioception and why it's important. So proprioception is our ability to sense where our body is in space. Now our mind wanders. It can have a thousand thoughts a second, some of them that we're not even conscious of. And by having that sense of groundedness, by using the club bell in conditioning exercises and in poses, it allows us to really tap into that anchor that we need to be able to stay focused and be able to execute what we need to do in our lives. So bear with me here. I'll start with introducing the focus poses for these exercises. These, these exercises will then help translate into the actual poses. So in yoga, you have warrior three, which is a closed hip balance pose. So I'll demonstrate here. Warrior three is where you're balancing on one leg. You might have the toe flexed or pointed, and your arms can be extended, or if you're modified, the hands are in prayer. This is a very challenging pose for most beginners or even seasoned yogis to enter. The second focus pose that we'll be exploring is tree pose. So in tree pose, you're standing on one leg. You can either start with the foot low or eventually place the foot very high on the inside of the thigh. This is a great one for opening up the fascia on the front line, so allowing the hip flexors to get a nice stretch and also provides you with a lot of balance. So you're activating your inner core, your pelvic floor, your transverse abdominals and your paraspinals. So everything in the inner core that allows you to keep your posture tall. And as you move into the more advanced pose, the arms might be up, maybe the arms will be pressed together, thumbs, thumbs crossed. <clears throat> now onto the circuit, the Pueblo Yoga circuit designed to help you strengthen those very challenging poses. Four exercises. The first exercise is called a yogi lunge. So you start at the back of your mat with your club bell in guard position. That means uh, if it's on the left, the left hand will be on top. Inhale, bring the club up and overhead. As you exhale, step forward with the opposite foot. Keep crown to coccyx alignment, find your shoulder path, and find stability in the yogi lunge. Inhale, bring the club back up and over the head. Exhale, step into the yogi lunge. So level one looks very similar to attack lunge. We've got 90 degree angles on both legs. And as you progress, you can straighten out the arms and take a slightly longer step so it starts to look more like the yoga high lunge. Key alignment points here. You wanna make sure that your front knee is not over uh, the front heel, so keep it grounded there. If you wanna regress back into more of a mechanically quick and fast version, we've got the tack, tack lunge here. So performing that on both sides with your club, you can get clubs at clubboyoga.tv. Second exercise, four corner balance drill. So start with a club in prayer position. I'll kind of pivot here so you can see all angles. Inhale, come to the tiptoe, lengthen up through the spine, recruiting the paraspinals. As you exhale, easiest variation, hip hinge back, and then tap your toe on the ground with the arms in flag position. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, tap the foot to the opposite side, arms in flag, inhale. As you exhale, reach the foot back. Inhale, the next hardest variation is to take the toe tap away and just hover the foot above the ground. Inhale, and exhale. Working on your proprioception, your ability to sense where your body is in space as you move through the conditioning drill. And so you would aim for about five reps, uh, one round through the front side and back is counted as one rep. The third exercise to heighten your proprioception and your focus is good morning to torch press. So you can start with the feet about hip distance apart, Place the club in a prayer position. Micro bend your knees if you have tight hamstrings. Hip hinge forward with a flat back, recruiting all of your paraspinals, the muscles in your back. Then as you exhale, spiral your arms and shoulders up towards the sky, coming into two-handed porch. Again, bring the club forward to load the spine in prayer position, hinge. You should feel a nice stretch in the hamstrings here. As you exhale, engage the glutes, the quads, the core as you press into two-handed Inhale on the way down, and exhale on the way up. You can also try a variation of this exercise where you are in a wide-legged straddle stance if you're wanting to train the ability to have hamstring flexibility in wide-legged straddle, which looks like this. Inhale forward, 
hinging of the hips. Exhale, press up, look up. And just by watching the club bell in space, so I'm tracking the club with my eyes, which brings a heightened amount of focus into my postures, into my poses. The fourth exercise, my favorite one, Warrior Three RDLs, Romanian deadlifts. Great for strengthening the glutes. You can start, the easiest variation is to create a micro bend in the knee, and then hip hinge back, which starts to load the glutes. Now extend your right leg with the tiptoe on the ground, and then hip hinge forward, loading the single hamstring. So very similar to the last one we did, but now we're on one leg. And then as you drive up, engage the glutes at the top. Easiest variation is just keeping that back leg touching the ground from the tiptoe. Then as you progress, you can start lifting the back leg. So micro bend, hip hinge, load the glutes on the left leg. And come up to standing and see if you can draw your leg up. Again, kick back foot through a flexed foot, square the hips, lengthen through crown of head. And then drive up, working from the glutes. To make it even harder, you can extend your club out into a 200 flag, square the hips, find stability here, engage the core, and then exhale, bring the knee up. I hope you enjoyed this little demo, Club Bell Yoga. Come play with us at Hacienda del Sol next month, and check out the website, clubbellyoga.tv, for all information and all home programs. Pura vida, namaste.